you know, with the ball in your hands and making the show? I feel like I'm adjusting well. You know, from first game to second game, one thing I want to do is build my turnovers. That's one thing I feel like I did. And just continue to keep playing, you know, just keep working, and just keep pushing the ball, keep doing what coaches want me to do. And I feel like these games, this practice, I'm getting more comfortable with the guys, you know, just learning, just learning just my spots and learning exactly what I feel like I'm doing. Just continue to keep pushing it and do what the coaches want. So I feel like that's what I'm doing. Do you feel you, you and, and Bryson kind of feeding off each other and, and talking out there of what needs to be done? Uh, yeah, no, he's, he, uh, I, love, I love playing with Bryson. I love playing with all the guys. We have a great group of guys. That, we have a great team, actually. But, but in terms of the guys, the guys probably get a great group of guys. You know, with him, when he gets it, I'm able to run it. Run it the bush, you know, when I get it, he's able to run it. So it's being interchangeable and being able to play with a guy like that. It's really fun. We see a coach talking to him, but sometimes, you know, hollering at you. And like you said, you got thick skin, you're, you're able to handle it. What does he tell you, though, that, that you need to improve on? Or, 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 you know, what is he telling you that we're not saying? Uh, he just wants me to just keep pushing pushing the ball. I'm putting pressure on the defense. You know, he just feels like I, I'm, I'm real fast and strong and athletic. So you know, I'm able to use use that use that ability to my to, to my strength. You know, it's really not a lot of guys that can stay in front of me. And that, and that helps our team a lot too as well. And when I'm able to put pressure on the defense and face shots from guys like Buddy and Ross and Joe, all them guys that can shoot. You know, and be able to fly bigs too, get them involved. So just, just keep pushing the ball. And just, be, be, be able to know when to attack when not to win, so I'm really cool and stuff like that. What have you learned through these two exhibition games? That, you know, the good, the bad, and, and the ugly, so to say. I know, just protecting the ball, you know, that's one thing that I always do. Protecting this. I, I feel like I'm getting more better. I'm just getting more comfortable you know, from the first game to the second game. You know, just, just to be able to hit, hit shots, you know, uh, take the smart plays, and I, I try to force a lot of things. Just, just play within the game. You know, the game's not to me. You know, try to force it. I feel this team's kind of chomping at the bit. You guys have been together for, uh, it seems like, a while now to, to finally get things rolling against Virginia. Yeah, it, it, it's real fun. I'm mean, looking forward to that now. That's, that's our next game. So uh, each package, we're going to just focus on, focus on uh, the stuff that they, they, they do. And be able to, we're going to be ready for them. So be excited. Be excited. Obviously, a different Virginia team. And a lot, lost a lot of talent off that team. But, you know, what do you see? Your ACC play right away slapping you in the face that, that you uh, got to look forward to against Virginia. Uh, that's something we're ready for, you know, just playing playing against the, the defending national championship. That's it's no, it gets no better than that. So just be able to just come out and be ready. You know, we came out slow today, but you know, just be able to come out and send that first punch and just let let the whole world know 